SIP is a text-based protocol, like HTTP and SMTP. SIP has various applications such as VoIP calls to set up a video and audio meetings, as well as instant messaging. SIP is a communications protocol used for signaling to control multimedia communication sessions and it can be either UDP or TCP. Voice over Internet Protocol SIP clients typically use UDP on port numbers 5060 or 5061 to communicate signaling information to both the SIP servers and SIP endpoints. Let us see the basic signal flow when a call is initiated. John dials Harry's extension number. John's phone send invite signal to SIP server. The SIP server sends 100 trying response immediately to the John's phone to stop the retransmissions of the invite request. The SIP server searches the address of Harry. After getting the address, it forwards the invite request further. Thereafter, 180 ringing generated by Harry's phone which is sent to John's phone via SIP server. When Harry accepts the call, the phone send 200 OK to John's device. Now acknowledge is sent to Harry's device from John's device and the session gets established and RTP packets start flowing from both ends. Now if any one of them ends the call, by signal is sent to opposite user. Let's say Harry ends the call, hence by signal will be initiated and sent to John's phone. John's phone will reply with 200 OK which will close the dialogue.